Now, MIT did a study about the use of generative AI in corporate projects. Many companies were investigating it, but only a fraction did a pilot. And the amount of successful implementation is just shocking. Only 5% saw return or some amount of success. The other 95% was wasted effort or just outright failure. And this brings into question how sustainable these investments truly are. Now, we are not saying AI won't revolutionize the world. I believe it's going to change everything and will obviously be bigger than the internet. But the problem is the level of hype being sold by Jensen Huang, especially him. He is telling everyone the obvious, but refuses to address the concerns about the bubble head on. So you're saying, no, this is not a bubble? I think this, we're, we're well in the beginning of the build out of intelligence. And, and the, the fact of the matter is most people still don't use AI today. And someday, in the near future, almost everything we do, you know, every moment of the day, you're going to be engaging AI somehow. And so between where we are today, where the usage is quite low, to where we will be someday, where the usage is basically continuous, that build out is... is Here's the issue. Investors, especially those on Wall Street, they are hungry for return. The more AI investments don't return a good investment, they know what it means. Less business to all these hyperscalers and other borrowers. And they could cascade to defaults on bond payments and suddenly the creditors, they get screwed.